I said no. For the first time in my life, the first time in 10 years anyway, I want exactly what I have. I want to see her smiling in the morning. Or I want to walk in here and find you drinking coffee looking like a million bucks. Or Colby and her friends draped all over the place playing with Jenny. I'm talking about you and me. So am I. What do you want from me? I can't even work the espresso machine. And I know that, you know, you and I took it out for a test drive once and we crashed and burned. But I also know that uh, this seems to work. You know, you and me as friends and roommates, parents. Like a charm. Yep, like a charm. We got it all, don't we? We got, we got, we got donuts and we got chili and we got teenagers we barely know. Free grazing through our refrigerator at all hours of the day or night. And I love it. I'm in love with it. Me too. Mm -hmm. And I think Jenny is too, aren't you, sweetie? Yeah, well, she's the point of this whole thing. We can do for her what we couldn't do for Jamie or Babe. I give her two parents, you know, and a home that's loving, that's secure, that's stable. Yeah, it is chock full of love. She's a lucky girl. Yeah, well, she's not the only one. I consider myself pretty lucky, too. <laughs> oh, Dad, I do love you. Mm. And this life that we're building. Okay, well, then do me a favor, okay? Promise me you'll take care of yourself, especially when it comes to Adam. Oh, gosh, you don't believe me. You don't think I'm going to let Adam reel me back into his life. There's no way that's going to happen. Mm-hmm. Great. You, you, you don't believe a word I'm saying. Okay. Nope. Would you watch Jenny? Just watch her. I, I, I'm, I'm going to go take care of something. Oh, Lord. Here we go again. Our whole...